Hi again, students. I have my beautiful camouflage vest on that I wore to make two other recordings today. I'm going to make two more. This is my first one in the grammar section. Adverb clause review. It's very, very important that you know how to write adverb clauses, sentences with adverb clauses correctly. So we're going to go through that now. This guy says, look. So I'm going to start on a very, very basic one, because. There are two ways to use because. In the middle of two sentences and to start a sentence and then you have two more, two more sentences. An adverb clause is an adverb plus a sentence. Then you need the main clause, which is another sentence. So because I love animals, period, that is not a sentence. Because I love animals, comma, I don't eat them. Again, an adverb clause is an adverb plus a sentence. That's an adverb clause. You always need another sentence with your adverb clause. Then you have a complex sentence. Okay, so let's read through these very, very carefully. I cannot see these mistakes to let you go to level six. Okay, and it's not very hard. You just have to focus. Okay, because I love animals, I don't eat them. Here is my adverb clause. Here is my main clause. If I put them together, I have a complex sentence. Because I love animals, comma, I don't eat them. I don't eat animals because I love them. My adverb clause, my main clause, put them together and I have a complex sentence. No comma here with because. I don't eat animals because I love them. No comma here. Just a comma here if you start the sentence with an adverb. Okay. Even though I am a vegetarian comma, I get enough protein. Here's my main clause. This is my adverb clause. Put them together, I have a complex sentence. I don't want to keep repeating that, so just remember, adverb clause has a sentence. Main clause is a sentence. Put them together and you have a complex sentence, okay? We need to use complex sentences correctly. Okay, I get enough protein even though I'm a vegetarian because of loving my dog, and you remember preposition plus ing, because of loving my dog, comma, I take good care of him. I take good care of my dog because of loving him. Despite being small, comma, my dog has a big bark. He really does. So despite means the same as even though. So if I were to say the sentence with even though, I would say, even though he is small, he is small, my dog has a big bark. Despite, just like because of, requires a gerund. The gerund of is, is being. Remember, we studied this last week or two weeks ago. Despite being small, my dog has a big bark. My dog has a big bark despite being small. He is small. I cannot say despite he is small. No. Despite being small. Is becomes being. If you need medicine, you can get it from an animal. You can get medicine from an animal if you need it. Okay, that's the real if. Conditional, if you had corona, you would feel very sick for a while. You would feel very sick for a while if you had corona. For the conditional if, remember, if, past tense, would, verb. If, past tense, would, verb. Then we have a time, a time clause, which is when I go online, the first thing I do is check my email. The first thing I do when I go online is check my email. All of these are adverb clauses. This one is called, in particular, a time clause. 
when I go online, before I go online, after I go online, while I was going online. Those are time clauses. They're not if clauses. They're not because or even though. Okay. While I was working, my dog was sleeping. Usually when I have the ing form, while I was working, I'm going to use while, and then I'm going to say it here. My dog was sleeping while I was working. So that means at the same time, and it lasts a long time. After watching my show, I went to bed. After, while, when, and before, I can just put a gerund or noun if I want to, because they are also prepositions. After watching my show, I went to bed. I went to bed after watching my sh show. While working, my dog was sleeping. When going online. So you can always put a gerund or a noun after when, while, after, and before. I went to bed after watching my show. Or I went to bed after I watched my show. After I watched my show, I went to bed. Or after watching my show, I went to bed. The first thing I do when going online is check my email. Okay, number 19. You will take ESL, take ESL until your English is perfect. English is perfect. You will take Eng ESL until your English is almost perfect. It doesn't have to be always perfect. Until your English is almost perfect, you will take ESL. Then what you're going to do is you have to make 10, 12 complex sentences using these sentences to start with or to put in the middle. I'll give you an example. I will keep studying English. I will keep studying English because I need it to go to university. I will keep studying English because of going to university. I will keep studying English even though I'm tired. I will keep studying English despite how, despite my English being good. I will keep studying English when my mother comes here. I will keep studying English while my brother studies French. I will keep studying English after I go back home. I will keep studying English if you keep studying Chinese. So. You can use any of these eight sentences, and I want you to use all of these, and then what you're going to upload will be one assignment with 12 complex sentences. Good job. And if you need to meet me, then of course you are going to meet me um, on my calendar and make an appointment or email me, and we will have a chat. But I want you to remember these sentences. They are very important. Bye.